안녕하세요. Welcome back to another episode of my channel and as you can see today here I'm in a very special place I have brought you to Hanam Dream Hugeto which is just Hanam um, Dream it's just like English like Konglish and Hugeto means um, rest station basically so I'm not sure if you guys know about rest stations in Korea but you can travel um, 국내, 국내 여행 국내 여행 is like um, travel inside the country. I know it's something very special uh, towards country who are, which is big and then you can travel to other cities. Not like Singapore, we have only one city which is our country. But here I am at the one of the nearest rest stop to Seoul. So what happened is we are actually on our way to Chinhe. So please stay tuned for more spring vlogs after this. Decided to stop by here for lunch before we continue our journey to Chinhe. So before that, um, I decided to come because I really wanted to show you guys um, what are the rest stop delicacies that you should eat and what the Koreans eat when they're at this kind of places. So I'm gonna try to spend within $30 sing, which is about 26 to 27 SGD in this place and I will show you how much food you can get from here, okay? So without further ado, let's go. Nucky went to throw rubbish in his Oh, this is so typical. Hot dog. Yeah, and the, and the twist potato. The best part about being in a rest station is you know how you always look for street food and um, it's all over the place. Like for example, you want to eat um, corn dog and you want to eat topoki and you want to eat omok but all might not be in one place. But the best part about a rest station is all of it is gathered in one place. So you can get everything at once without walking too much. So let's try. What do people usually eat at rest stop? Depends. Depends. I think if you're gonna eat, of course eat, then buy some snacks. No, what's the the snacks is like corn dog, right? So tok so tok, which is sausage and tok like tok, right? And then oh. we have like tokoki So tok so tok I think is quite nowadays is a new thing. Yeah. And then the what the not fungopang the hodu kaja. Hodu kaja. Hodu kaja yeah. is like um red bean yeah. snack. Okay, I will show you later, but I'm talking Walnut. about meal. 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 Uh. Yeah. What do people eat at restaurant? Ramyun, ramyun, ah, ramyun. Ramyun. And but now, now this really like tonkas, some place oh, tonkas, tonkas, right? ramen, tonkas. Jige, because you have to name different, three. different area has a different specialty, but That's I think true. ramen can't go wrong, jjigae uh -huh. can't go wrong. Uh -huh. And? Tonkas maybe. Okay, so let's go in and see there. Okay. The best part about this place is now, right, all automated, so you don't have to talk, so you don't have to worry about not being able to speak Korean. You can just press, 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 and go and collect it according to your number. Hmm. Oh, there's a lot of food, eh. <laughs> This Hugeso itself, it divides the stores according to Hanshik Korean food, ramyeon, and udon. Okay, so usually you can see what is famous here. Like for example, see they say the ramyeon is good, and then the chige is good, dendang chige. But usually people order what they like to eat lah, basically. So what I will try is ramyeon. Total? 15.5 It's really very fast for you. You don't have to worry if you don't know how to speak Korean. You just have to look for the number 493 and you will all show there. So you all come out from one place. While Naughty waits for the food, I'm going to try to get some um, snacks. So maybe hot dog. Yeah, maybe I'll grab some hot dog. Let's see. There's omuk as well. The omuk looks so good. And then they have takangjong, kamja. Kamja is something that people eat often also when they're here. They have like a roasted sweet potato, so that's a really nice snack. Like this one, that they get. That this is the hodu gaja that I was talking about. This one. So we buy it for on the go later, but let me get some fish cake. The best part is you can order it here also. Ta-da! So, hold the This one. Mm, should I get anything else? <gasps> I think that's good enough for now. Okay, let's order this. And then just insert the card. Again. And then it's done. Okay, let's wait for it to come out. 
you can put um, sauce. They have yum yum chicken, ketchup, and mustard. Usually, I put this too, yeah. <laughs> Guys, I made a mistake. 30,000 Korean won is 32 SGD, not 25 SGD. I'm so sorry. So, right now we spent about 22,500. So, we got about $8,000 left. So, not $8,000, 8,000 won left. Let's see what we can get. So we already ordered the food and we're gonna explain to you what it gets. It's the cheese tonkatsu. They call it tonkatsu. I don't know why. Is it like a Japanese or Korean? Ton? Ton means pork. Katsu, katsu. Katsu is just katsu. This is a very typical rest of food. The second typical rest of food is this one, the ramyeon. This one is tok ramyeon. And this one is chong, what kimbap? Chong kimbap. Chong kimbap. So you're supposed to eat it together. Like I'll show you how to eat later. We got the omok and then takkangjong. And then this one is the hodu guaja, which I will show you later. It looks something like that. Walnut. Walnut. Hodu is walnut, right? Yeah. Together, this cost, how much was the takkangjong? Five. Five so 5, five plus twenty two five so that's about two seven five two seven five oh oh so we kept within our budget <laughs> okay I always hear from mukbang mukbang YouTubers that ramen tastes best when someone cook it for you so let's try hmm hmm Really tastes nice. The cream, the soup is very like creamy and savory. You just eat it like that, is it? I think so. I, I'm ah. not a big fan of it, so I hardly eat it. <laughs> I think Sorry. you're supposed to just eat it like yeah. that. Mm. It's actually very plain without kimchi. Mm. It's so nice. Mm. Mm. It is so good. Very crunchy and sweet at the same time. Kimchi. Mm. So, nice. so this is my artwork. Oh, you spray, yeah? Yeah, I spray the sauce. I also show them how to spray. Okay. Mm. Nice. Mm. And then this now, a very good weather to eat outdoors. Ah. Okay, my baby turn. This is actually, actually this is famous for the kids, huh? Cause kids love. Katsu. Yeah. And I ordered cheese one. Hey. And we call it Pyongyang chic like this when the so sauce sprayed. Look at the cheese. Can see? Yeah. Come on, come on. Is this one of your favorite foods? I think. Huh? I think so. Very nice, ma. He like this and chicken only. Yeah. Mm. Is it warm? Mm. It's nice? Mm. Mm. It's so good. Mm. It's a, nobody won't hate it. Will hate it. Wow. The cheese is very chewy. Like it gives the texture of a very soft. Mm. Very crispy. To be honest, the meat is not much, but the sauce wraps it up very nicely. Mm. Very nice. Mm. Is there a reason why they always give little bit rice only? Don't know. Eh. <laughs> the king jungs. Mm. I suspect it might be a bit hard because they kept it really. Oh, is it? It's been there for some time. Right. <laughs> this is a very typical food, also lah. It's just mm. that because it's street food, just like any other street food in Myeongdong, they also will cook it and just leave it there. This you get all the food are nice, this one a bit not nice I think. The street food lah. This is actually a little bit cold so. Yeah. But all this food is good. This so, one I think is good to the good to go to the Hugeso which has a lot of people because they keep making it. Yeah, makes sense, makes sense. So But you have to queue. Oh my god, god, I bring stupid chopstick. Yeah. I hate this. I think you'll like it so much this. Mm. It's good. Mm. Mm. Mm, babe, you look like uncle. <laughs> Try to eat like a young man. Mm. <laughs> babe, what, uncle? Uncle. 
Mm. This one better. <laughs> so last but not least, I'm gonna try this one and let you see what's inside. Since it's still hot lah. This is the only thing that's hot, so it looks something like this. Can you see this walnut? Mmm. <laughs> what is the red bean? And the walnut. Mmm. This is a very typical snack. I think it tastes nice with coffee, so maybe later we'll buy coffee and eat this in the car. What is it like in Singapore? Do they have? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, I want to have. Me. You, actually, Singapore have pizza. Tampak pong. I feel like this kind of experience, you come to Korea, if you have a chance to drive it, if you are driving, I think it's not bad to stop by a rest stop or just visit it so that you can experience the Korean culture. Not everybody was staring when I was filming because obviously there's not much foreigners here. What's so special about doing this I think what's so special is in Singapore don't have don't have any other city but Singapore. Indonesia have that's why. Like this. Yeah, How's got, it like? Got Starbucks, got KFC. Oh got yeah, 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 right, 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 right. I went before. Oh, that one's quite nice also. But the best part about Korea is the weather is nice. For now. Yeah, when it becomes actually hot also I like lah. But when it's cold right, we definitely cannot sit like this. Makan time. Oh, hmm? limousine be. Wow. Okay. Not talking, man. Mm. It's so big. Wow. But here is near, so if you go to the Kangwondo there, they got more beef. If you mm. go somewhere, they got more seafood, so you can enjoy the delicacy of that. Please. This big. Mm. They're not gonna like it though. That cold, eh? <laughs> wow. <laughs> Tastes like this water sponge, no? Back to the food. Mm, don't, don't, don't say that. I'm being honest, which is nice, which is not nice. Mm. You can get a so -so -so -so. This one is a point thing, but not bad. This one, wow, wow. <laughs> Maybe Kumi also the one to eat one. <laughs> really? I know you when your dad comes to a restaurant, he likes to eat ramen. But Maybe ah. Uh, I like to order Sundubu Jigi sometimes also. Mm. So eat. Some cars and food go together. You can petrol pump, pump petrol. Mm. Some sort of that. Off the about the at the about. Top up the <laughs> tall <laughs> cut, tall cut. People always ask me how come I can speak English so well. Me, I don't think I speak well. Really? Yeah. But they always ask me. Don't you have one foreigner friend who can speak like me? I think every Singaporean have one foreigner friend who speak like me, no? I don't think so. Somehow you are Korean. Okay, that may be unique because I'm Korean, but I think not. Don't have to be Korean. Mm. No me? You roast something. I find it interesting when I first time came to Singapore. You know, it was interesting the accent. Mm, accent. We're kind of done with the food already. As you can see, we just like hurruk and everything finished. The concept of the rest stop is you are here to have a quick meal so that when you're done, you can just get on the on your way to the destination that you're going. So on the way to Chinhe. We decided to stop the one nearest to Seoul because if you guys are interested in visiting, of course the one nearest to Seoul will be the most appropriate. But if you would like to know more about the famous like rest stops in Korea, maybe when I'm traveling to Daejeon or Daegu, I can do another series. I can do another film. But I did film it long time ago, one, one of it. Lah. And um, it was just a very short video. So this time around, I wanted to do a really full version of it. After you finish eating, of course you have to return it and Naughty went to return one of it already. There's a return tray station, is it? It just, it just dropped. We're gonna grab coffee. I don't know if Naughty's still gonna eat. He's like, I don't know, he like want to eat a little bit more. Huh? <coughs> they say today got promo, you buy one noodle, one donkas, free jjigae. So I was okay, let me claim it. <laughs> Food. Ah, I didn't want to like eat, but they give free. Uh. How? Until. How's it like? Mm. Where's the egg? Yeah. A bit plain. You want to try? This is an experience of Korean culture that not many people will get. So if you see in dramas and stuff and you think it's interesting, this is about an hour away from Seoul. I hope that you guys one day will get to try this kind of thing. I had a lot of food and I'm super full now, but I think I'll eat a little bit more hulu later when um, 
Naughty buys coffee, so. So well, here it comes to the end of the rest stop station vlog. I hope you enjoy us watching us eat the food. And if you want to know where we are, we'll, I'll leave the location link in the description box down below. And yes, please let me know if you want to know more of this kind of content. Thank you so much once again and I'll see you in the next video.